Controlling bandwidth allocation for today's traffic diversity is a combination of an art and a learned skill. Using the Packet Shaper provides invaluable insight and management capabilities, allowing you to achieve maximum efficiency for your network and organization. By using a rate policy for a class, you can ensure that a session gets its fair share of bandwidth. You can also prevent a flow from unfairly impacting other applications. A rate policy is especially suited for traffic that tends to burst. For example, let's look at YouTube, consuming over 90% of our available bandwidth. If shaping is not enabled, YouTube can scale to fill our pipe. Using traffic management, we can see that YouTube has consumed over 65 megabytes of bandwidth and we need to get that under control. We can search for YouTube and other applications or categories by name or sort the data by peak BPS and determine the top offenders. Once you select the class, you can view a report for the individual class or application and then click on Policy Manager to build a policy to control this traffic. A policy determines how an application's individual flows are treated in the context of competing applications and allows you to manage bandwidth management on a flow-by-flow -flow basis. With policies, you can give each flow of mission-critical traffic the bandwidth it needs for optimum performance, as well as protect it from greedy, less important traffic. Using a rate policy for YouTube allows us to determine the amount of bandwidth that can be used. Once the policy is created, we can turn shaping on. You can see an immediate impact on YouTube and the ability to prevent users from consuming the entire connection with recreational video.